video, we will be taking a look at the Looney Tunes minifigures. Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. In this video, we will be reviewing the Looney Tunes collectible minifigures, minifigs, for this is a 2021 minifigure set that comes out April 26th. So, in this set, you will get Porky the Pig, Daffy Duck, Tweety Bird, Bugs Bunny, Marvin the Martian, Wily Coyote, Petunia Pig, Speedy Gonzalez, The Road Runner, The Tasmanian Devil, who also comes with some tops, Lola Bunny, and Sylvester the Cat. So now let's take a look at all, all of these minifigs closer. And then at the end of this video, I will give you some, some tips and tricks on how to find them if you don't want to buy a case like I did. So let's get into the video, everyone. Here we go. Okay, everyone. So now we are going to start going through the minifigures one by one. So first we're going to start with Porky Pig. So Porky Pig has this nice sign that says, that's all, folks. And some nice print on the front. And no, nothing on the back. So, oh, just a nice tail there. So, how to find this minifigure is feel in the bag for this one 2x3 tile, which is the only, type, only of its type. And should be pretty easy to feel for. So that's the tips and tricks for Porky the Pig. So now let's go on to the next one. Okay everyone, so now we're on to the next minifigure which is Daffy Duck. So Daffy Duck has this sign in his hand that says Rabbit Season. Some nice coloring. They did a good job on the head of this minifigure. He's got a real tail. And how to find this minifigure. So try feeling for Daffy's sign here, the two by two. And then try to find the clips because they will poke through the bag. And there's no other minifigure that has a two by two sign with the clips. So now let's go on to the next minifig. Here we go, everyone. Okay, everyone, so now we have the next minifigure. So the next minifigure is Tweety Bird. Tweety Bird all around is okay. It would have been better if it had uh, a real tail instead of this printed tail. But overall, it's a pretty good minifigure. So how to find this one? So in this one, you're going to look for the 2x2 two two round bricks that are right here that create the hammer. And that should pretty much give it away. Tweety you can find almost instantly. So now let's go on to the next minifigure. Okay everyone, so now we have Bugs Bunny. So Bugs Bunny's got his carrot in his hand there. And some nice printing on the front. And some nice bunny feet there printed on the feet. And unfortunately, once again, I wish it had a tail but instead it has a printed tail piece. So now how to find this minifigure is feel the, for the bug's ears, which are long and sharp to confirm with the, and confirm with the carrot, which feels like a short club. So that's how to find Bugs Bunny. So let's go on to the next one. Okay everyone, so now we have Marvin the Martian here. So he's got a nice gun in his hand, his nice skirt, and his helmet, which underneath that helmet, they did a pretty good job on this minifigure. They just used a minifig head with some eyes printed on it. And then the helmet just clips on top. So how to find this minifigure is feel for the Marvin's helmet. 
in this piece in particular because his helmet is large round has a, has a shape for his head the plume brush is attached to it so it'll feel quite distinctive so let's go on to the next one everyone here we go okay everyone so the next one is Wiley Coyote so Wiley Coyote has a nice anvil sitting in his hand. It's a nice print on the front with those claws on his feet there. Nice headpiece. I like this beak here. And he's got the 3D tail on the back there. So how to find Wiley Coyote? Feel for Wiley Coyote's snout. It is a pretty distinctive snout which is really long and pointy. There are also plenty of small elements which, elements which should rattle about in the bag as well. So that's how to find Wiley Coyote. So now let's go on to the next one, everyone. Okay, everyone, so we've got Petunia Pig here. She's got a nice teapot and tea uh, cup in her hand. Nice skirt piece, some nice ponytails. So now how to find Petunia Pig is feel for the skirt piece. And which is hard and rigid with grooves and curves in it. So that is Petunia Pig. Here we go on the next one. Okay everyone, so now we have Mr. Speedy Gonzalez here with his piece of cheese in his hand. Some nice claws on the feet there, nice bow tie. And a nice mouse tail on the back there. Oops. And his helmet is actually, and well, his helmet and head are actually all one piece. So now how to find Mr. Speedy Gonzalez is try feeling for Speedy's large hat, which is very wide, has a very wide brim that's sunken in. You can also feel for the plethora of cheese slopes. But be careful not to confuse it with the Wily Coyote, who also has the cheese slope piece with it. So, I'd say confirm with the cheese slope, but look for the hat, the hat mostly. So, that's Speedy Gonzalez. So, let's go on to the next one. Okay, everyone. So, now we have the Roadrunner here, who also came with this little cup of stuff here, or bowl, rather. So he's got some nice wing arms and a nice feather up top there. Nice big tail. Overall, I'd say this one's a pretty good build. So now how to find the Roadrunner. So try feeling for the Roadrunner's chicken wings, which are attached to his torso and feel quite large and bumpy where you expect minifigure hands. So that's how to find the Roadrunner. So now let's go on to the next one, everyone. Okay, everyone. So here we have the Tasmanian Devil. He's got his chicken leg in one hand and a pie in the other. Nice tail on the back. It also came with this spinning top piece. Uh, he's got a nice big head. So now how to find the Tasmanian Devil is find the fidget tile, which is large, round, and flat. So just feel for this. It's all you gotta feel for to find your Tasmanian Devil. So now let's go on to the second last minifig. Everyone, here we go. Okay everyone, so here we have Lola. Lola's got a nice orange ball. I presume it's a basketball in her hand there. Nice ponytail, some nice print on the side of the legs as well as on the front. So now how to find Lola. Oh, and she's also got a nice printed tail on the back there. So now how to find Lola. So try feeling for Lola's bunny head, specifically for the ponytail, which should be noticeable sticking out of the back. Confirm with the round spear that is meant to be her basketball. So that's how to find Lola. Now let's go on to the last minifigure, everyone. Okay, everyone, so now here we have the final minifigure, which is Sylvester the Cat. So Sylvester the Cat has a nice bat in his hand, some nice printing on the front, and some claws on the back. And then he's got his tail on the back there, which, uh, once again, is a 3D tail. 
So now how to find Mr. Sylvester the cat is try feeling for his baseball bat, which will feel long with some groovy handle, with a small groovy handle rather, at the base. It will feel much thicker than a regular Lego rod piece. So that's how to find Sylvester the cat, everyone. Okay, everyone, so that is going to be all for this video. In this video, I've shown you how to find all 12 of these Looney Tunes minifigures, and I've given you an up close and personal look at all 12. So please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.